What is up guys, Fern King Code here, a channel where good games and good vibe vibes meet. Welcome to the channel, or should I say welcome back to the channel. Today is Thursday, 24, 2020. We are going to resume Coffee Talk. Despite losing a member, Super Smile's latest album sold a million copies. Stop workplace racial profiling, the Orkish Workers Union demands. Welcome, yo. A cup of honey milk, please. Right away. Alright, honey milk. Let's see, honey milk. If I imagine it has just milk and honey, right? Pretty much. So honey milk, right? So just like so honey milk. Alright, honey milk. Milk and honey milk. Honey milk, let's go. Your honey milk is ready. Thank you. You're welcome. Freya! Hey, Franken Code. Seems like there's a cat. Oh my god! She got in with me! Relax, it's okay. Hey, kitty cat. What are you looking for? Want some milk? Oh shit! <laughs> Hi, barista. Yes, I love some milk. Holy, you look like you've seen a ghost. No, I mean, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to be rude. It's been a while since the last time I saw a nickel money transfer transforming. We really do that in public. I guess you don't have that many nickel mini friends. I won't say I have. You both usually use your feline form to commute. If I'm not mistaken, that's right. Well, c c com commuting as a, as, a, as a cat sounds more practical. Like that, that commuting as a hum. I mean, that that commuting in a bipedal form, kind of. Anyway, before we continue, can I have my milk, please? Oh, I'm sorry. What kind of milk do you want? Just milk. No additional stuff or anything. No milk and nothing else. No, milk and milk. Okay, just milk then, okay? All milk. Let's go. Warm, cool, and sweet. Okay? Cool. Just milk. Fresh milk for the lady with a pretty smile. Thank you. Are you hitting on an underage girl? I was just giving her a compliment. Thank you for the compliment. It's really good. You're welcome. What's a young girl like you doing this late? I'm not a young girl. I'm a grown-up who can take care of herself. Hmm. You don't look like a grown-up. What? I'm 18! Yeah, that's exactly what I call too young. Well, I'm not an old lady like you for sure. Besides, I've been earning a living since I was 13 years old. So I'm definitely not a kid anymore. How? I'm sure you know. Uh, I don't. Oh my. Are you? Just say it. If this is something illegal, or if you are in danger, blink twice. Really? With a cute face like mine? Exactly! Seriously, you've never seen me on TV or social media? I don't want to sound like a snob, but I don't watch mainstream media. Snob. Part of the broke out, part of the broke but woke movement I see. You must be the broke part. I don't see you ordering any drinks. What? Too broke for a cup of coffee? Ah, <laughs> She's not that great for, for, for business, no. Oh, really? Sometimes I wonder. Could this coffee shop survive without me? What are you waiting for, Grandma? Make your order. Is this some kind of maid cafe experiment or something? So, what do you want to order? The usual. Yeah, her usual is just the coffee. Yeah. The, the cappuccino. The, cra the cappuccino. Oh, that's not, not the cappuccino. The espresso. 
Your espresso is ready. Hmm, as good as usual. Glad you like it. Wait a minute. You do look familiar. Are you are you in a pop group? Are you Rachel Florencia? The member of Super Smiles who just graduated and started her solo career? Uh-huh. You're not a lost cause after all, Grandma. That brings us back to my first question. What the hell are you doing here? Drinking milk. I'm serious. But you, but you can see it with your own eyes, right? I'm really here to drink milk. How come this coffee shop attracts so many weird people? Well, while we do have a lot of unusual customers, this is the perfect time we've had a, a famous celebrity visit. To drink milk, no less. <laughs> Yay! Achievement unlocked! No, seriously. Why, 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 are, why are you here? Well, you know. The usual young folks' pro problems. I had, I had a fight with my father. And so, here I am. Ah, I see. But is it okay for a celebrity like you to be alone this late? You don't need to worry about me. I can turn, I can turn into a cat. Now I'm really worried. Anyway, what happened? My dad, we got into an argument. He doesn't like my line of work. He always saw my profession as something negative. But I love what I'm doing. What about your mother? What are your thoughts on, on, on your career choice? She passed away a few years ago. I'm sorry to hear that. It's all right. Your dad know. Your dad know anything about the entertainment industry? He used to work in, in showbiz decades ago. So yeah, he does know a thing or two. Oh, someone, someone just walked in. Hey, it's Georgie. Good evening, Fern Franklin Code. Good evening, girls I've never met before. I just saw you yesterday. Just kidding, Freya. Anyway, Franklin Code. Yes, officer? I need something for my sore throat. Can you get a, a brother a cup of green of green tea with lemon and honey? Oh wait, can you get a brother a cup of green tea with lemon and honey? It was yeah, it, it, it was that it was that one tea in the that one tea in the in the loading screen. So green tea. Oh wait, yeah, here it is. Green tea with lemon and honey. Lemon and honey. Okay, let's go. Okay. Cough syrup. Okay. Your special drink is ready. Well, well, well. What do we have here? It's it's, it's my special cough syrup. What do you, what do you call it? Uh, cough syrup? <laughs> of course you do. Let's see whether this drink tastes as good as it smells. Damn, this is great. How's your day going? Anyway, anything out of the ordinary on your patrol? Yeah, anything interesting today? Actually, I witnessed something scary on my shift today. Tell me, tell me! You sure you want to hear it? Yes! The scary thing I witnessed was my salary. Seriously? <laughs> yeah, today is, today is payday. And I checked the ATM during my shift. Such a horrible sight. Other than that, the labor of union protests, everything is just fine, though. How can you say that? It's fine. We got a young celebrity lurking around by herself. Ain't that strong proof that, sh that this area is safe? Hey. Thank you for the drink and space and place to, to sit. I'm going back now. Oh, thank you for coming. Hope you enjoyed your time. Uh-huh. Who the hell was that? She just sat there and read. I'm sure that that's pretty normal in a coffee shop. I mean, you always do. I, I mean, you always do that here when you're writing. I guess you're right. Anyway, where, where were we? Oh yes. What are you doing here, young lady? It's pretty late, you know. I don't have anywhere else to go. And this place looked cozy. I see. So you basically wanted to go to, go to a bar. But you're underage, right? 
How did you know? You can read you, you can read minds now, old man. I have a daughter around her age. It's easy to translate what they say, especially when you have to deal with them every day. I don't know why you're here, but any, but everything's gonna be okay. You can forget all all your problems while you're here. Dude, you're a cop. It's not his job to take care of someone else's daughter. He he is a cop. That that is exactly his job. Relax, Freya. Don't be so uptight. Yeah. Mr. Policeman here made me feel much safer already. You know it yourself, Freya. This place is very safe. Right, Officer Georgie? Of course. This is the safest place around here. Hey, that endorsement comes because of the discount, right? <laughs> what? Don't look at me that way. You're a cop, old man. Act like one. I deal with crimes and public safety. How should I know how to handle someone else's daughter? You should know. You are a father yourself. Oh, right. Guys, you you know I can hear you, right? Really? See, Freya? She has good hearing. That should help her protect herself. Any, anyway, Miss Rachel. Miss Rachel, what brings you here? As I told the others, I had a fight with my dad. <laughs> why are you laughing? Me and my daughter fight every day. Hey, why would you say that? Because it, because it's true. I fought a lot, a lot with my kids. That's normal. In fact, whenever we finish arguing about something, we be, we, we become closer as a family. Huh? Because when things have come, calmed down, I learned something about them. And they learn something about me as well. As long as we as we don't leave things unresolved, an argument makes things better. But it happens so often. Tonight was just one among countless others. He wasn't like this before. Before it happened. You mean before your solo career? No, before mom passed away. What happens after each fight? Hmm. Nothing. We just don't talk about it until. Another fight starts. Unresolved problems are dangerous. It ain't easy, but you got but you gotta understand each other each other better. And as much as I hate to admit it, conflict is always the best way to know someone. Even even your own blood. That's true. But it was never this bad when mom was around. She's the only one who who understood me, and she also understood your father. Maybe he and your mom had also had arguments, but your mom acted as as a as a as a as a as a, as a, me, as a meditator between the two of you. That's possible. Now that now that mom's gone, I don't have anyone to act as my guardian. And your dad, he he lost his best negotiator. Wait a second. You said this has happened a lot. But why did you run this time? My daughter never ran away. Wait, maybe it's because I'm the one who, who always who always ran away, using my job as an excuse. I can confirm that. Yeah, I run here a lot. But yeah, I hate to tell you again, you both got gonna resolve your issues. Unresolved problems are dangerous in any relationship. I kind of understand what you're going through, Rachel. I also ran away when I was younger. Are you on good terms with your parents now? I am. When and how did that happen? To be honest, I'm not even sure myself. It just happened. Maybe I should run even farther. I mean, I have my own income. I don't. Even, I don't need to rely on my dad. Yeah, I, w I would. Rec I wouldn't recommend that. Why? I'm an adult. No adult would ever say I'm an adult. <laughs> That's also true. Just give yourself time to think, Miss Rachel. And try to understand your father's perspective. I'm sure both of you will be able to solve this like adults. You don't need to r rush to, to a decision. I'm not sure about that. Just take your time. But now, now I would recommend you just go home. It's really late. I need to go home as well. I can give you a ride. But you don't need to talk to your father right away. Just go straight to your room. At least, at least knowing you're safe at home will give him some peace. 
That will allow him to think more clearly about everything. You're right. You, you really are a cop, Georgie. Of course I am. So where do you live, Miss Rachel? In the western part of Neko Town. Oh, that's quite far. You're still going to drive me home, right? Are you, Georgie? Old man? Of course I will. Should I drive you home too, Miss Freya? No, you don't have to. I'm riding my bike. Are you sure? 100% sure. Okay, we'll be off then. Thank you, Frank and Code and Freya. Take care on your on your way home. See you around, Frank and Code. And there they went. Yes, you can stay longer if you want. Nah, it's fine. I also have to call it a day. How's the writing, by the way? It's getting there. That's nice to hear. I'm not, I'm, I'm not nudgling a lot of work though. Oh, I'm juggling a lot of work. I'm sorry. <clears throat> juggling a lot of work though. Barely made my deadlines. I don't know if I can keep this up. Why don't you just come clean? Tell your boss about the publishing offer. Who knows? Maybe she'll understand. Yeah, you're right. Great job, Freya. Here, take some money. Go take a vacation and finish your novel. In your dreams. I'm not exactly employee of the month. You never know. You never know. I might end up on the on the chopping block. Oh, the pressure. I'm sure about one thing, though. This coffee shop has a lot of stories to tell. So yeah, I'll probably be back tomorrow. The door is always open for you. <laughs> I bet it is. Okay, then. Take care. Be careful on your way home. Cappuccino, Italian delight. Friday, September 25th, 2020. All right, gamers, I'm gonna stop the video right there. I'm having a lot of fun with this game. This game is actually really cool. Really, 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 really nice, really calm, really chill, relaxing, I, I like it. I love games like these. So, if you guys enjoyed the video, make make sure make sure you like and subscribe. Have a great rest of your day. Peace out.